Space junk is an important concern today. There are tens of thousands of objects in low Earth orbit. There are many millions of objects that are too small to be tracked. Uh, all of those objects present risks to orbiting satellites, both manned vehicles as well as unmanned communication satellites. A single collision between two pieces of orbital debris or potentially a, an active satellite and a piece of orbital debris could create a new debris cloud and that cascade could cause severe damage and potentially even eliminate the ability for us to use the LEO orbit for potentially years. And that could impact global communications, our ability to predict the weather. At Los Alamos, we've been working in solid rockets, traditionally solid rockets. You ignite them and you get one burn, you get one thrust, one impulse out of them. We have been working to enable using a single solid rocket grain for multiple independent burns. With a solid rocket that you can store on board a satellite in a safe configuration for potentially decades, and with the solid rocket's ability to provide a large amount of thrust instantaneously, one can avoid potential collisions on orbit. In developing our system, we wanted to avoid hazardous materials. We decided to build our system around launching water, and once a thrust is needed from our rocket system, we would use electrolysis to separate water into hydrogen and oxygen so that we could later burst that hydrogen and oxygen gas into the chamber, use a spark to ignite it, and that flame would then ignite the fuel. Low Earth orbit is a natural resource, one that we need to protect for future generations. And we're hoping that our solid rocket system will provide another tool in the toolbox for protecting that natural resource.